Good day, everyone. Thank you for joining me. I am Tamara Kukshinovich, and I'm going to take you through Toyota's interim results. Toyota stands out in a sector that seems currently strained. The group is trading in line with its long-term average to the sector. This is justified by strong balance sheets, leading technologies, and strong cash generation. Toyota's downside risk is limited due to its quality of operation and low valuation multiples. Consumer confidence and interest rates are the company's primary drivers in terms of prospects. However, the evolving regulation to reduce pollution is a tailwind. The impact of trade tariffs is uncertain, but it will most likely result in higher costs. Despite this, volumes are expected to be sustained. The new global architecture is likely to reduce costs by 20% through the use of common parts. This cost reduction and the reduction in incentives should result in higher net margins in the medium term. However, the group remains vulnerable to currency swings and earnings will likely be depressed due to its dependence on the North American auto market. Net revenue increased by 3.4%. Operating income increased by 15.1% as cost reductions, improved product mix and improved profitability in the financial services division outweighed the increase in raw material costs and higher marketing spend. Diluted earnings per share increased by 18.8% to 422.68 yen. An interim dividend per share of 100 yen was declared. The Dow Jones Global Titans 50 weighting of Toyota is 1.5%. We feel the group's strong balance sheet and the dividend is sustainable in the current trading environment. The share is attractively valued, trading at a forward PE multiple of 8.2 times. Our recommendation is overweight, with a portfolio exposure of up to 6.5%. If you would like to place a trade, please speak to your financial advisor or contact the dealing desk. A comprehensive company analysis report on Toyota can be found on the PSG online trading platform. Before we end off, please take note of the following disclaimer. Thank you.